yes guys welcome again uh, today we are looking at a toyota wish this is what, 2010 we have the check light in oh, that's not in the check light the vsc vsc and this one look a bit blurry it is a traction control light so we are going to do a bit of scanning and see what are the faults that we have today and today we are going to be using the launch scan tool all right so we have the diagnostics toyota i think v48 here yeah. This car, it, 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 it drives well, somewhat fair, in a fair condition, but those lights need to come out and this is a Taiwan made and it is the one without the smart key, so it doesn't have a smart key as you can see. It's regular key there. Um, yes, so it's, a, it's a wish 094 cylinder. So we're gonna select if we do the, the power train one first. Read fault code. Oxygen sensor heater control circuit low bank one sensor two. Valmatic drive learning value current circuit um, bank one there and then engine stall history rough idle and then we have the oxygen sensor heater control circuit low bank one sen okay so that one repeat so we are gonna clear what we should do yeah all right, we're gonna clear this one and see what happened and they are gone going to check for any additional problems Quick scan. and with this with this scan tool it can do a lot of stuff even the relearning of the valvematic uh, that could be done using this scan tool it's a pretty much good investment to have if you decided to go full time in automotives all right so we have a fault in the abs system so we're gonna check that one out and see what it is read fault code engine control system malfunction all right so let us just clear that and see what happened So we have no lights now. It's a bit. I'm trying my best to get it to focus, but we have all the lights are gone now. Okay, so basically those lights just came in. Um, for what reasons? Yeah, it was not clear, but see we do a bit of reprogramming and all of them are gone now so check it check uh, no we don't want to exit so we're gonna check through the system and all yes all the the the, the different section of the ecu is okay we see the pcm is okay the css sorry the CCS, the cruise control system, that was the, the one that, that one came out and initially. And then we have the the EMPS that are that was okay and then the SRS was okay and the rest of them was okay. So basically 
the lights were in they are gone now so we're gonna do a bit of restarting now So basically I reprogram the, the PCM and all the lights are now gone. Let me see if it responds. And it responds to the throttle very attentively. So, so from time to time things can happen to it. They are all electrical parts so things can happen and it needs to be reprogrammed. Alright guys, so basically this is how I clear ECU using the launch scan tool and thanks again guys, please remember to like, share and subscribe um, thanks for all the new subscribers that I've received shout out to you guys and thank you very much for supporting my channel and um, thanks again, catch you in another video